Hey everyone, DMV Solar Rider here. I thought we'd start today's video with a little image of yours truly, or at least as close as I can get to one in this really dark window. And over there is my 2019 Indian Chieftain Dark Horse, greatest motorcycle known to mankind. As I mentioned in past videos, I'm not the biggest guy in the world. I'm 5'7", so as you can see right there. Uh, I got plenty of leg room on my bagger, uh, and I'm not a big guy. Got my little backrest in here. It really is like riding on a lazy boy. I couldn't be happier. Got my highway pegs, no problems. So with today being Memorial Day, I figured we'd head into the city, check out some monuments, check out some memorials, some cool parts of town like Georgetown, the infamous K Street, and just see what's going on. Uh, I don't know if you know this, but Rolling Thunder, that annual Memorial Day motorcycle parade in D.C., uh, no longer exists. Uh, the organizers apparently decided last year would be the last year for the D.C. motorcycle parade, and they've instead farmed out like many Rolling Thunders to communities all across the country. So we might see a lot of motorcyclists in D.C. doing their own thing. We might not see any, but I thought... If nothing else, we can do a little solo thunder. And the 14th Street Bridge feeds right into, you guessed it, 14th Street. There's a beautiful shot of the Washington Monument. That's going to be our first stop on our little Washington, D.C. Memorial Day tour. There is no traffic here already. I mean, you're seeing cars, but this is nothing. And my guess is, on Memorial Day, this road might not even be open. I know Rolling Thunder, I think they start at the Pentagon, and then roll into DC. And this would be the way they do it. This, or maybe the Memorial Bridge by Arlington National Cemetery. I'm gonna try and stop at some of these places and just shoot around so you can get a sense. That's the National Holocaust Museum. Independence Avenue. And here we are entering the National Mall. All the museums, most of the museums are that way. There is the Washington Monument, beautiful. That is the Capitol Building. This here on the left is the African American Museum, which I think is awesome looking. And a lot of the other Smithsonian's are all down that way. Air and Space is back there. We're gonna pass it. Right now, we're just heading over to the White House. motorcyclist not a lot of people out I mean this is absolutely nothing for tourist season and a national holiday there's nobody out here this big building right here is the Department of Commerce we're gonna drive by the White House the ellipse I think uh, hopefully we'll get a shot of the second division war memorial it's for both world wars and i want to say the korean war there's also a first division memorial but i don't think we'll ride past that one and then we'll loop around we'll hit the lincoln memorial the korean war memorial vietnam memorial arlington national cemetery at least as close as we can get Here we are on Constitution Avenue. That's the White House grounds to my right. We'll get that movie theater shot of the White House. There it is. 
beautiful. There is the second division memorial. Very cool. Not the best view. We'll get another one. I'll dice and splice and get the shots that we want. over the Memorial Bridge into Arlington National Cemetery. It's absolutely beautiful. And it looks nice too. <laughs> I think Arlington might be closed, but we'll just ride up there and go around the circle. Hopefully you can get a good shot of that from here. It's so cool looking. Oh, look at that traffic. That's not good. We'll see if we can cut around here. Oof. We're not doing that. No way. We will head back. DC. Ride down Independence towards the Lincoln Memorial. A lot of cars parked. Not nearly that many people. Oh, I know what we're going to have to do. We're going to have to loop the back around and do the World War II Memorial as well. is the World War II Memorial. One of my favorites actually has more meaning for me than the others because my grandfather was a World War II vet. Army Corps of Engineers, Purple Heart, Bronze Star, when I was a little kid, I used to ask him to tell me his old war stories, and it didn't matter how many times he told them, he always cried. And there is a great shot of the Lincoln Memorial. I think that will do it for us on that score. There's the Jefferson Memorial under renovation. Here we are back on Constitution. We are about to head up again towards the Lincoln Memorial to get a, see if we can get a look at the Vietnam Veterans Memorial. And there it is right there. That's the entrance to the Vietnam Veterans Memorial. Can't really see anything from here. See where that wreath is. Oh, that might be part of the Korean War. I can't even tell. If you look really straight back through the trees, you see some black granite. At least what looks like granite. I think that is the beginning of the wall for the Vietnam Veterans Memorial. It's basically, it's like a wall cut into a hill really amazing we'll go up 
up 17th Street, get the other view of the White House for you. There's the movie White House shot. What's that? We're we'll headed over to Capitol Hill, see what's going on there. Look at that view. Constitution Avenue. Supreme Court on the left. Beautiful. That's the old Library of Congress. Capitol Hill Visitor Center and Capitol Building. That's the new Library of Congress on the other side of the street. We're going to head down past the House Office Buildings and the Air and Space Museum, and then head out of town. Went to the Native American Museum. I like it. Space Museum. Looks like it's going under some work. Oh, and that round building just past the Air and Space is, I think it's the Museum of Modern Art. It's a complete and utter waste of time. I'm sorry, the one time I went in there, it was a sculpture exhibit. And yeah, I could throw a bunch of metal together, weld it, and say it's art. I mean, it is really the stereotype of some dude taking a black canvas, putting a red dot in the middle, calling it art, and some doofus is going to sit there staring at it for hours talking about how amazing it is. Not my cup of tea. This is art. And that is a yellow light. Back where our little trip started, 14th Street, Washington Monument on the National Mall. Just gonna flip around and head back out over the bridge. Well guys, hope you enjoyed that brief Memorial Day 2020 tour of Washington DC. Town's a lot quieter than I've ever seen it, but it's still beautiful. Hope you guys had a great Memorial Day where you are and I will pop in with another video as soon as I can. Take care.